It was time to upgrade TVs finally after several <laughs> 15 years of marriage. <laughs> <laughs> That's several. And my wife said, hey, let's buy a bigger TV. And you know, your eyes get big. Well, I'm a researcher. That's why I love review videos. So I got to work and we got the right TV for the right value. And I have to tell you about it. Hey guys, I'm Scott with Before You Buy, where we do product review videos for you to make sure it's what you want before you buy it. And again, today we're talking about the TCL 4K HDR 55 inch Roku Smart TV, which also comes in a, either a 43, 50, 65, or even up to 75 inch TV. First and foremost, the picture looks absolutely fantastic because it's an LED with HDR technology. Uh, and since it has the built-in Roku, it also comes with that Roku remote. So some people don't actually like this simple Roku remote. I absolutely love it because it's just like any other modern device. Uh, over time, they start to change based on the application. Well, now you're mostly navigating using up, down, left, right, and enter, right? You're typing using that. Or you can even connect with your phone with this device. So why have all these million different buttons with TV inputs and all that? Why do you even need that? Now there's software on your TV, which is absolutely incredible. So I actually prefer this super tiny, simplistic remote. Sometimes I do use my phone when my kids are got the TV on and it's super loud in the other room. <laughs> I'll just turn it down when I'm in the other room. And the kids are like, Dad, are you, is that you turning it down? Uh, and I just start laughing. <laughs> Sorry, kids. So the Roku media system on the TV, there's 500,000 channels, but obviously you're going to probably install the Netflix, Hulu, YouTube, Spotify, maybe Pandora channels. Uh, we even have a channel from our church that we installed on our TV that we can watch Sunday morning services, which is fantastic. And it even connects with your Google Home or even Alexa. So you can even say, okay, Google, play a calming music playlist on my TV and it'll start that up or sometimes I like to throw in the okay Google play the fireplace playlist and it'll actually start a fireplace we always do this for Christmas time which is absolutely hilarious real quick if this review video is helping you please consider using the links down below that actually helps buy me a cup of coffee I get a little little kickback from Amazon on that but you pay the same price but it does give me a little cup of coffee because right now it's 3.03 .03 in the morning and that's when I record my videos because everyone else is sleeping right now. It does come with three HDMI 2.0 ports and one of them includes the ARC or ARC, which is the audio return channel. If you don't know what this is, that's okay. Uh, it basically allows you to power on a sound bar. You plug in the HDMI into the sound bar and it's actually fantastic because the sound bar will then turn on when you turn on the power to your TV and boom they both turn on instantly it's absolutely fantastic we're living in the future folks one actually feature it has that I wasn't expecting was I am actually on American Ninja Warrior fun fact uh, if you watch season 11 Tacoma City Finals you'll see Scott Barron's Backyard Ninja Kids on American Ninja Warrior uh, so but we're, we watch NBC, American Ninja Warrior, uh, on regular TV, right? It's crazy. <laughs> but if you hit the up button, it actually brings up the TV guide. I didn't know it had a TV guide. Uh, but it's so cool that it just pulls that data from the internet, I'm assuming. And, you know, you're able to get that TV guide built in right there. That's pretty sweet. I was a little nervous with this price point when the first ones I bought. Uh, so my, my main job is I, I'm actually an IT guy and a church production person at our church. And it this is fantastic for our TV carts at church. And we've been using them for multiple years. They're pushed around from room to room. And this TCL brand, even though it's not Samsung, it's not LG, the build quality is good enough that it works great in a setting like that. So I thought, well, it's definitely going to be great for my house sitting on either, uh, you know, home entertainment center or mounted to the wall. It's going to last. That's for sure. So again, I think this is an incredible price point with the 4K HDR built in, you know, Roku TV, all small bezels, thin, light, good build quality. At this price point, I, I just, we're living in the future, folks. I can't believe there's TVs for this price point, this day and age. But if that video helped you, I ask that you just use those links down below. It gives me a little kickback. Helps me keep making videos for you. Uh, until next time, if you have any questions, 
leave them down below. See ya.